Hey everyone, Force Restart here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix no sound on WhatsApp status by following these steps. So let's get started. So very first thing is if you have WhatsApp open, right, just go ahead and close out the app by swiping upward. So close it out and then go ahead and relaunch it and just simply go ahead and try to see if you can get sound. Now if it's not working, the next thing you want to go ahead and do is make sure your phone is not in silent mode or vibrate only mode. So on iPhone, for example, if the toggle is down here, you just want to make sure it's up so that the ringer is on. Now, if you have a newer phone, you may see action button. You may need to just press and hold on to it until it's turned off. Or you can go into your setting and then look for sounds and hectics. And you may see a silent button. Um, you want to go ahead and turn that off as well. Now, the next thing you want to go ahead and do is pull down that control menu and then make sure that your phone is not on do not disturb. If it is, we need to tap on it to turn off do not disturb. And that with that turned off, you also want to make sure the volume here is up or use the volume up button to make sure you actually have the volume turned up so you can actually hear the sound. A couple things to check. Now, another thing you also want to check out in your setting is under Bluetooth here, you want to make sure it's not connected to some other device. You may want to just turn it off and see if you can play the sound in WhatsApp. So go ahead and open up WhatsApp and then your status in the video. And if it is, then you know it's connected to another device, which it's looking to send the sound or basically the output the sound from. Now, if you're still having issues, the next thing to do is update the WhatsApp app. So usually for this, you'll go to App Store or Play Store on your phone. And then in the search, you're going to search for WhatsApp. So I'm going to search for WhatsApp and then tap on WhatsApp. And if I see the word update, I'm going to go ahead and update it so you can update the app. Now, if you see open instead of update, the app is already up to date to the latest version. It's always good to update your app in case there is any bug fixes. So once that's open, go ahead and try again to see if it works. Now, if it doesn't work, another thing you might consider doing is just deleting the app and reinstalling it. So long press and hold and then remove delete app. It's not going to delete your account. It's just going to delete the app. And then when you can go back to the App Store or Play Store and search it up and reinstall it and just sign back in. Now, if you're still having issues, the next thing to do is go ahead and restart your phone. So depending on the model of your phone, figure out how you can do it. For iPhone, you can use the volume up and the side button at the same time to a sold and then slide to turn off and then turn it back on using the side button. Or you can say Siri, restart my iPhone and it'll do it for you. Or from the top here, you should see a power icon here. You can just click on that and then slide to power off and turn it back on. So different ways to turn it off and restart your phone. And lastly, what you want to do is make sure your phone software up to date as well. So in your setting, in your general software update, update your phone software. Sometimes previous update software might have caused issues with WhatsApp not working correctly. So it's always good to update your phone to the latest version. So by following these steps, your WhatsApp sound should be fixed for the status I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.